Hello everyone, it's Michelle Patterson here with Angel Souls and this is our daily card reading for February 9th, 2020. So check out what we have today. We have Citrine Abundance. Now, can this mean money? Of course, that's where we're so human, right? It's always like, where's the money? Where's the money? Uh, yeah, sure, it could be that. But this is an abundance of understanding. And boy, does it light up your life. I mean, you see how that card is radiating? That is what the potential here is for you today if you embrace it, if you connect into it. It's sort of like, oh, I understand now. Now I don't have to worry about the little things. No, I really don't have to worry about this, that, or the other. Yes, I can turn my health around. Yes, I can turn my situation around. You know, whatever it is, yes, I can have love, but I can have love on the terms that are comfortable for me uh, and, and the highest good of everyone involved. You know, it, it, I can define my own life. This is an abundance of understanding yourself and what your needs and wants are and what makes you happy. And with that knowledge, now you can start creating. We had that fertility card, I don't know, a few days ago or something like that. And this is that kind of creative life force that starts to awaken in you. It's like the springtime of your life where there's a fresh beginning, a new start. And now you have the tools, everything that you've already been through. That's part of your toolkit. So when you go out there and maybe you are trying something new, now you're completely empowered to do so. Now you're not going to repeat the same lessons. For some of you, you know, if you're in a relationship and maybe you learned that being guarded and being um, standoffish within a partnership, maybe you came to some understanding that you were like that because you were afraid that you were going to lose the relationship or that you were going to get hurt or that whatever and so you're trying to show like i can be strong you've learned from that and so this abundance of understanding is talking about okay if i do end up getting into a conflict with my love partner i know now that i need to listen more or i know now that i need to sit with myself first and get honest about how i'm really feeling not just trying to win the argument, but, you know, tune into how I'm really feeling and being honest and putting it on the table. Nothing can bring people closer in some situations than just leveling with them. Leveling because it shows that you respect the dynamic that you have. It shows that you trust the other person with this vulnerable information. And you can even say, you know, whatever's on your mind. I'm afraid you don't see me. Can we talk about that? Right? Um, I can't guarantee what the other person's going to do, <laughs> but just being open and honest, you know, that that's part of what this abundance card is saying. It's a free flow of your true authentic self. And you don't feel like maybe you have to hold back so much and you don't feel like you have to hide who you are. You can radiate and you can shine. All right. So we're going to leave it there, guys. I'm sending you so much love and take care. Bye-bye.